This video uh, is about several objects in the area of Alexander the Great Square. So, uh, stone bridge uh, was built on Roman foundations under the patronage of Sultan Mehmed II. And uh, origin, uh, most of the stone bridge originates from the Ottoman period and uh, throughout the centuries the stone bridge was often damaged and then repaired. I did this video in February and there is already flowers, <laughs> it's winter. So, uh, near the stone bridge uh, there are uh, two uh, monuments to great uh, revolutionaries of North Macedonia, uh, Georgi Derchev and Damian uh, Gruev, yeah. and uh, who uh, at the end of 19th century, at the beginning of 20th century, they fight it uh, with uh, Ottoman authority with Ottoman Empire for the independence of North Macedonia. So this stone bridge is the most historical bridge uh, in the Skopje. On the back side uh, of this video there is a historical museum. This is the square of Alexander the Great. Everyone knows uh, of this person. <laughs> and uh, from the uh, back side of this monument there is a small sculpture of King Samuel, a Bulgarian and a North Macedonian king who conquered this area uh, from 971 up to 991 and uh, during the reign of Samuel uh, the kingdom occupied most of the Balkans. Uh, some Composition, I don't know its name, <laughs> to regret. Yeah, this boy <laughs> who clean your shoes. Such compositions, uh, there are a lot of in many countries. This is Portico, it was erected in 2014. And uh, it's, uh, how to say, uh, symbols of the uh, struggle for independence in of North Macedonia. There is again a stone bridge. And uh, these monuments, uh, which we see ahead, there is a uh, Philip Thot, <laughs> and uh, who uh, ruled this area, this kingdom, uh, in uh, fourth century uh, before uh, Christ BC. So uh, now you can uh, evaluate. It. At approximately at least that uh, it's right <laughs> that a lot of people call uh, Skopje city of thousand sculptures so you can personally uh, come to Skopje and to check <laughs> 